girl hey girl how you doing it is monday morning the vlog that y'all will see today was filmed over the weekend and you have one more vlog that you you all will see that was also filmed a vlog over the weekend i can't even talk this morning but it is monday morning it looks like it's gonna rain i just came from dropping the boys off the school i have to wash and dry today wash clothes period you put wash and dry you know i gotta do girl what is my bun doing but that's what i have to do today but anyway hey girl hey girl for those who are returning hey girl how you doing how your mommy your daddy your auntie your uncle your cousin and all them doing blessed i know hey girl for those who are just tuning in don't fly by stop by scroll by go ahead on and subscribe 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 okay and press your post notification bell because we are lit over here obviously and you want to come see me but anyway <laughs> That's what I'm getting into this morning. Um, I do have to go to the bank because Mondays, y'all know I usually go to the bank on Monday, so I do have to go to the bank today. I don't know what all we gonna get into, but that's that's what's going on, girl. We play catch up, catch up, get it together, catch up. Ain't got much to do, but that's what we're doing. But I will uh I'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit. I don't I don't even know what I'm gonna talk about, but I feel like I need to talk to y'all today. Instead of just doing, 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 doing. I want to have a conversation with y'all today, girl. How y'all doing? I want to have a conversation with y'all today, girl. If that's all right. If y'all want to talk to your girl a little bit, a little bit like that. I don't know which way the conversation going to go. But I just want to talk to y'all. Because I feel like I don't ever really talk to you all. <laughs> I just be doing, 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 doing. I come in here and there. I guess that's what vlogging is. But I just want to talk to y'all. I want to talk to y'all. I'm going to do a story time one day. But... I got a few stories that I need to tell, girl. A few stories that I need to tell. But that won't be on this vlog. I got to go through and navigate and see what story I won't put out there first, okay? Because, you know, I got to be mindful of what we do, okay? And I'm going to be real, real, real. So if I can't be real, 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 I won't tell it, tell it, tell it, tell it, tell it. Period. But I will holler back at y'all once I get inside. I pray everybody's having a fantastic Monday and I pray that your week is blessed and fulfilled with everything that you needed to be fulfilled with period don't let nobody stop you don't let nobody stop you and tell you what you can't do as my bun is about to shake off my head don't let nobody stop telling everybody your ideas stop telling everybody your ideas because they will implant something negative in your mind that will sometimes sometimes ultimately stop you from doing what you desire to do okay stop telling everybody your ideas sometimes you gotta hold that thing and wait till that thing come to pass period you gotta hold that thing and wait till it come to pass sometimes you're blessed with something in your spirit your ruach that tells you this is what what you need to do to get to what you need to get and if you do this you're gonna get that and here you go telling somebody because you're so excited which we should be able to share but baby 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 that's not always how the world works because everybody ain't for you Everybody that's smiling in your face ain't for you, okay? So keep some of that to yourself, sister. Home girl, hey girl, woman, queen. Keep some of those ideas. I don't know why I'm doing this, girl. Like I got a bundles in my head, a uh, uh, lace front, okay, twirling the curls. But anyway, it just feel good. It feel good. But um, keep those things to yourself. Keep those things to yourself. You don't always have to tell everybody. What's going on? My husband texted me, say, what you doing, beautiful? <laughs> Running my mouth. But I will holler back at y'all once I get inside because I got to text my husband's baby because it's my booty thing. We still hunting morning. And what? And who going to tell me we came? And who going to tell me we came? Bye. Again, I know I don't always say the days because I just made vlogs. And you're going to see one five days a week, period. However, order or whatever it go okay sometimes i just forget to say uh the day and i also make videos sometimes on the weekend so if i make a video on the weekend you'll see that first so why i don't know but anyway y'all get it but anyway back to the point back to the pines um the kids are off of school i know i was supposed to be doing a morning routine with them it's coming it's coming it's coming i just been having a lot going on period y'all know all the hats that we wear as women and then we pick up on other stuff okay I'm a wife, a mother. Well, first, I'm a strong believer. Wife, mother, and I also do YouTube. 
And I also have a, um, my own business, a small business, where I sell lip gloss, lashes, bonnets, body sprays, body uh, creams, body scrubs, what else I sell? Bath salt, um, body oils, essential oils. I sell a lot, okay? I sell a face mask. I have candles, but candles about to go on a big sale because I'm not gonna be doing candles for a minute, okay? A pop, uh, if I do candles, I, I don't know, we'll see. But candles won't be on this website right here no more. Um, I'm narrowing things down. I didn't start talking about too much, but I'm narrowing things down to what I actually want on this website and, you know, doing my duck thizzle. And candles just don't fit. And I also do melts. Candles and melts just don't fit the mark of what I want this website to be. It has to go. When I had it on, I'm just rambling. When I had it on there, I was thinking of what I do to relax. Like, I like to smell the smells of my mood. Um, when I take my bubble bath or my hot shower, you know, everything was about pampering. Us ladies being pampering, pampered and pampering ourselves. So that's why it is on there. But I don't know. I don't know. It costs a lot of money to make candles, baby. And they're not moving the way I want them to move unless I do a sale. People lack saving money. Yo, my candles are very reasonably priced, but they just lack saving money. Y'all know how it is. Y'all know how they do. But it's all good in the hood, okay? So, but I do have an online business created Faithfully Cosmetics. Go ahead and check that out. All the links are down in the description box. I'm trying to get more fluent on social media. I am an older woman, a grown woman, okay? So there's a limitation to what I will put out and expose myself, allow my family to be exposed to because of what I do, okay? Like I said, I'm a strong believer. I am a wife, I am a mother, and I have a 25-year-old daughter, okay? 21-year-old 20, um, son, a 18-year-old, 15-year-old, 13-year-old, you know, all that just. So I have to watch what I do and how I move. First of all, me as a person and who I am. Not who people think that I should be, but how I perceive myself. I didn't even know this was going like this, but let's keep it going, okay? This morning, I'm currently washing clothes. Y'all just heard the washing machine stop. I think that was the washing machine. The dryer is still going. So I'm going to take that load that's in the washing machine out and sit it on the side and put... No, that's my last load. That's my last load. But I have clothes that also need to go in the dryer. That's waiting for the clothes to go in the dryer to go out. So I just let it sit for a minute until the dryer is done. You understand where I'm going with this. Y'all know I'm always washing, folding, ironing, cooking, cleaning, and all that good stuff like that. Not because I have to, first of all. Because my husband does help me. He does cook. But my husband also is the one who leaves the house and go and uh, make the bread. Okay? Y'all might not see him like that. I ain't got to get into that. This is my channel. This is Sonera's journey. But he goes out and he makes the bread. So I try to make it, at, when he come home, I do my best to make it, I'm a wife. That's all I got to say to that. But anyway, we have a lot going on. A lot is going to happen on, that's coming up in the upcoming vlogs in the near future. Just keep your notification bells on. Stay tuned so y'all can see what's going on. But anyway, back to what I was saying. Um, I'm not knocking nobody who do anything because to each is his own. And I'm in a whole nother era, an age group, an age gap. So we have to be mindful. I mean, in, as, a, as a female, an individual vote, I'm talking about females because that's what I am. As a woman, we have to be mindful of what type of content we put out there pertaining to who we are as a person. Don't ever deny yourself of being who you are. So what fits you may not fit the next person. We, we, you will never um, get recognition or gratification or acceptance from everybody. Like, if you do, check yourself. You need to evaluate yourself because something is wrong with that picture. Period. Okay, we're going to have haters. That's why I say love your haters. Um, I'm currently just sitting in my den. Y'all who watch know where I'm at right now. But, uh, and I'm hardly ever in here, but... This, this is my husband's chair that he refused to get rid of, and it's actually very comfortable, as you can see how I'm sitting in here right now. I don't have my tripod stick. I think it might be in the car. I don't know, but I don't want to go get it. 
So I'm holding y'all with my hands, so that's why y'all not like way up there. Cause girl, these is these is 40 over some arms, okay? They get tired. But anyway, <laughs> we have to watch how back to the point. We have to watch how we and what we put out because yeah, you can delete something, but it's still out there. You don't know who shared it. Blase, blase, blah. So we have to make sure you're happy with what you put out, that you're content and that it doesn't affect, what you put out doesn't affect your family in a negative way. If you understand where I'm coming from. So I'm trying to be more active on social media. Like I said, I have a lot. I have a business, uh, YouTube. Well, I have my YouTube and my, uh, for Instagram as well as Facebook, as well as TikTok. I'm not as active as I should be on TikTok, but like I said, I'm trying to get, huh. I'm trying to put out content that I won't mind seeing 10 years from now. Okay. <laughs> put it like that. Let's just put it like that. Um, and I also have my business, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. I have me and my husband share our personal, you know, Facebook. He's not into Instagram. So I have my personal Instagram um, and TikTok. So that's that. So I do all that. So we just have to, I don't know. I'm just trying to basically say, I hope somebody understands what I'm saying. We don't live for people. You live for you and those who are attached to you. You understand where I'm coming from? So you have to put out content and things. I mean, living day-to-day -day life, even if you're not viewed on YouTube, social media, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Because some people really don't have any social media. They just don't do it. Okay. Which is fine. I'm proud of y'all, <laughs> for real. But uh, you have to be mindful because when you're connected to people, I'm just strategically uh, picking my words because people are ridiculous. But when you have people that are attached to you, it's a domino effect. What you do ultimately affects the household, ultimately affects your family. Look, regardless of how good you do it or how much you watch and how precise you are or what you put out, there will always be some negativity somewhere in there. I'm not saying that I had some, I have some, and it has came to me. I'm pretty sure it's out there, period. So you have to be mindful of that. You don't want nothing coming to your kids because if you a mama, mama, like for real, for real, you go to war for your children. So you don't want nobody telling your children nothing about nothing in general. So you don't want to add to the pot, okay? If you're a wife, for real, and you love, love, love your husband, like you love him for real, like you married him because you love him, period. Regardless of how uh, y'all don't always get along, the things that y'all may go through. I'm sorry my arm is all over the place because it's tired. That you're ready to rock with him regardless. That's what you married him for. You believe in what the vows say. Tell that to us part. Do sickness and in health, do good and in bad. If you if you're that type of woman, you don't want nothing coming back to your husband that will be displeasing to him, that will affect him on in his work environment, his workplace, his uh social life, his day-to-day -day life, his day-to-day -day living. You, you, period. And for my for yourself, for myself, for yourself, you don't want nothing coming to you where you have to shake your head at yourself. I'm just saying. But to each is an own. I'm a grown, grown woman, so I put out stuff, and even if I was younger, I'm not going to tell you that I ain't never had a Facebook that I was doing too much. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yes, okay, but that's not who I am right now. That's not who I desire to be, so I watch what I put out. But anyway, today I am, I've been talking to y'all for 10 minutes, OMG. I am washing clothes and stuff like that. I know that my daughter has to go. I don't know if I'm going to start another vlog and just put this out. Because this is, y'all comment down below what y'all think about what I'm trying to say here. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about what I'm trying to say. If you get what I'm saying, if you understand where I'm coming from, you know, nobody has to know. First of all, if you're a believer, I believe in the most high. I do my research and I do my study. The creator of heaven and earth. I call him Yahuwah. You might call him something else. That's fine with me. I don't knock you. Like I say, don't knock me. Which it don't matter to me for as that go. Because my belief is my belief. Okay? I can back it up. 
I can back, I can go far back, way back as far as you need me to go to get you the answers that you ask me if you're serious about knowing. But he says, my people perish because of lack of knowledge. You have to seek and find things for yourself. Don't just go by what the pastor, preacher, bishop, elder, a, a missionary, evangelist, whoever, mother of the church, you know, deacons. Don't go by what they say. You have to know for yourself within yourself because when you when it's all said and done and you're no longer here you you're accountable for your things behind your name it won't be the pastor the bishop the elder the deacon the missionary the evangelist the prophetess it won't be none of that it won't be none of that it will be you and what you did and what you didn't do you will be held accountable for everything in your life that you have ever done okay it's there now, I'm not saying he hasn't forgiven you if you have repented and asked, asked for forgiveness, but the things that you have done, we have to be held accountable for, okay? So, when it comes to me getting to heaven, which I call Shem I Am, when it comes to me getting there, I'm going to make sure that I do everything in my power and be responsible for myself, okay? The way I live and my lifestyle may not be agreeable to everybody else. Girl, that's fine. Girl, you don't have to even be concerned about what nobody else got to say about you. What you are doing with your life is fine. You do what you think is best for you and your household and your family and your walk. Because the measurement of my faith, the measurement of my belief, does not increase by what somebody else think about me. The measurement of my walk or how my walk looks does not increase by what somebody else has to say about me, about my walk, about what I do that that pleases my my heavenly father my abaya the most high my elohim it doesn't have to do with what nobody else thinks about me he said that we should be the uh light of the earth yes so the way i go through trials and tribulations may not look like how you go through it but it doesn't mean the way that you go through it is wrong and it doesn't mean the way that i go through it is wrong you understand where i'm coming from my blessings which i call it Berica. Just because my blessings may not look like your blessings doesn't make my blessings wrong. And just because your blessings don't look like my blessings or how we handle it, it doesn't make any one of us wrong. It's how your heart is, okay, and how you live and conduct your life according to what is told to you from him, not from people. Not from people who think they got authority and they can tell you what to do about how you're living and how your walk looks. Not because they say so or because they're older than you. We should respect our elders, but because they're older than you. Where you're at right now and the things you're going through may not have the outcome or the going through process or the overview or the blueprint of the way they went through things. The way their blueprint looked, the way their outcome was, or they going through was. You understand where I'm coming from? I, I hope that you get it and I hope that you catch it. I was coming on here to tell y'all what I was doing today and what I was getting into and it was supposed to be a vlog. But apparently that's not what's in my spirit right now. Like I said, I'm a believer. I don't always throw this on this channel. But I do make sure I tell you these things. And y'all may think it's just catchy and it's just a phrase. I believe in what I say. Love on your haters. Love on your haters because your haters just put you, push you to do greater. If my life is so rosy and I don't have, I'm saying me, okay, me. And I don't have nobody that has something negative to say about how my lifestyle is. If I don't have nobody looking at me under the eye that are turning up their lip. I need to evaluate myself because I don't want everybody to be my friend. My friend went to Calvary for me. That's my bestest friend in the whole wide world that was willing to give up his life because of what his father said, but because his father loved us so much that he wanted us to have a chance for salvation, a chance to get to know him, a chance to be filled up. Y'all call it, um, with the Holy Spirit, I call it the Ruach, okay? To be filled up with something not of this world. Because this world will pass away. All your riches, all your glory, all those things will pass away. It will pass away. It's not meant to last. It's tangible. I could just reach out and grab it. If you could get it, I could get it. What makes you better than me? Vice versa, what makes me better than you? But the things that he give, only he can give. It's untangible. Only he can hand it out towards each and every last one of us. Okay? He's our father. Only thing we got to do is seek him and look towards him and trust him. Even when it don't seem like it's, it's working out right. You ever been in a situation and then I'm again. You ever been in a situation where it seems the very thing that you're in just ain't, it ain't 
much as you praying, much as you trying to consistently do the right thing, it doesn't seem like it's going to work out in your favor because it's not going the way that you think that it should go. But at the end, it turns out to be exactly what you prayed for. The outcome of it at the end of the thing, he said, faith is not seeing. Okay. Faith doesn't come by seeing. Okay. Faith is the evidence of things unseen. Okay, so even though it doesn't seem like it when you're going through it, but the outcome is like, thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you so much. You know what your daughter, what your son needed at that moment, and you came through right on time. Okay, period. But that's pretty much all I have to say, and I'm about to end this because me talking to y'all is for 16 minutes. But I hope you, I hope that y'all catch it. I hope that y'all catch it, okay? But I'm about to go ahead and take these little clothes out of this washing machine, you guys. And out of the dryer and all that good stuff like that. Hold tight. Girl, look at my hair. I need to do something to that closet. Y'all see that? Don't look at that. Don't look at that. But I'm proud you know I don't, um. What? Who you talking to? Who you talking to? Talk that noise when this camera on you. Who you talk to, boy? What? So I... Anywho. They made my button fall down. I'm ironing up. I'm ironing up. I'm hanging up the boys' jeans. I don't like to put their jeans and their joggers in. And some of their shirts, I don't put it in the dryer because the strength could be real, depending on where you got it from. So we're not going to do that. And my baby's gross, so. I'm hanging up their clothes. But I just came back to go ahead and close out this video. I don't want y'all to be looking at my closet as I'm closing out this video. <laughs> I want y'all in my closet. But y'all go ahead down and leave y'all comments and your thoughts down below. Everybody views and points uh, the way they see and perceive things are different. Give me some insight. Tell me what you think about the discussion. Chat with your girls down in the comments section. Y'all chat amongst each other. If y'all have any questions to ask me, go ahead and ask me what you need to ask me. But just give, just give me what you think about this little talk we had that wasn't even supposed to be that. Well, I didn't know what we was talking about, but I did want to talk to y'all. I'm about to go ahead and end this vlog because I'm about to start yet another vlog, okay? I'm going to end this video and start a vlog, okay? So I will catch you all next time. Don't forget to leave your hey girls down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Remember, be blessed, be blessed. You are blessed when you're blessed because you're up and you're watching me. We love it on our haters, all right? And I will catch you all next time. <clears throat> next time. Peace.